still not in range yet. Lower right direction, still not there. Okay, today's get off the couch is a walk around the National Arboretum in Washington, D.C. Hey, you don't have to join a fancy gym to, to do any exercise. Like I've always said, the main thing is to get off the couch and do something. And today I'm doing something with my family. Hey, it's always fun to, to do some, be able to do something with someone. And of course, when you're doing something with your family, that's, that just make it more better, as Spike Lee would say. Okay, now we're coming up on the National Capitol Columns. You can't go to the Arboretum without visiting the National Capitol Columns, right? Uh, those columns were the original columns on the um, U.S. Capitol in 1828. I think that's the date. And I think in 1864 they decided those columns wasn't proper. Um, I, don't, I don't know whether they didn't have the um, right strength to support the structure or not. But anyway, um, they took them down, built some new ones. And those are the columns there um, from 1828. I think there's 22 of them. Um, I'm not sure and I didn't count them. And actually, in the park, this is one of the most, um, like they say, this is one of the most Instagram famous sites that people like to come out and um, photo, photo themselves. But I also understand in the national parks there in D.C., you're not supposed to have any professional photography done. Actually, while we was there, we saw two professional Instagrammers uh, trying to take pictures, um, I guess, with their props and stuff with the columns in the background. Uh, the National Park Service promptly removed them, um, stopped them for, um, for doing it. Anyway, um, it was pretty neat walking through there. Unfortunately, I couldn't get any pictures of them. Hey, I didn't want to give them um, any pub either. Okay, on to the next stop. I guess we're going to just walk through the garden a little bit just to check out some of the um, plants. I guess um, it's the end of winter here, so not really too much is happening. Um, spring is trying to spring. Um, I guess spring is trying to spring. Or is the spring trying to sprung? <laughs> anyway, it's not really too much. Some of the foliage is, um, is still dead. I hear um, during the, during the, when spring really kicks off, the azaleas really put on a show. I have to come back and check that out. I'm from the south, so um, the azaleas really put on a show in the south. So I would like to see what happens in um, D.C. Um, here at Arboretum. Anyway, on through the park. Okay, we're finished. We headed back to the cars. Uh, let me see how many steps I got in. Uh, I got in roughly 6,000 steps. I thought I would get in more, but hey, 6,000 is better than 1,000, right? The main thing is get off the couch, move. Hey, we have to keep this diabetes things under control. And that one thing I forgot to mention, you saw Honey there. If you've been watching some of my videos, you know, Honey is the grand dog. So, um, Honey got out too. That was um, great for her. She probably enjoyed it more so than any of us. She got a chance to chase a few birds, even though she was on a leash. But, hey, the simple things that make for dogs to have fun. Okay, so I'm, we're headed back to the house now, and I'm feeling a little hungry, so... We're going to fix something to eat. I haven't done that in a while, and I'll see you back in the kitchen. Okay, I'm getting ready to fix something to eat. I haven't done this in a while. Um, if you've been following the channel, everyone knows um, I, I hate to cook. I really hate cooking, but I think cooking does help with controlling your diet. Um, you learn different things um, about different foods, how they are prepared. So when you go out or you're eating someone else cooking, you you know what's good for you and what's not. So anyway, like I said, I hate cooking, but one thing I can do, I can't follow a recipe. So uh, today I'm going to make these uh, garlic mushrooms I got off of Delight. 
um, site, Cafe Delights. Um, I will put the link in the bottom. I'm going to contradict myself. I said I follow of the recipe. When I first saw this, I said this looked very good, but I think if I add some shrimp to it, it would taste even better. So I'm going to deviate from the recipe a little bit and add shrimp. Okay, here I go. Okay, now it's time for the big test. Let me see what I've done here. This is really good. Yes, this is really good. Shout out to Cafe Delight. The link where I got the recipe is down in the description. The description. Yet. I did add some shrimp to it. This is very good. You guys need to give it a try. In a way, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. See you on the next one.